If you go to a hospital, you realize that all the medical gas pipelines are made up of copper. But have you ever wondered why do we use copper in medical gas pipeline systems? As we all know, medical gas pipeline system is required by all hospitals. It is mandatory in ICU, OT, emergency and different sections of the hospital. But all of these gases are transferred using copper pipeline. Well, the reason is that copper tubes are used in healthcare to transport medicinal gases to ensure that medical gases do not become contaminated and requires an extremely clean and smooth inner surface. Well, the high pressure withstanding capacity, corrosion, resistance, durability and ease of installation of copper tubes makes it an obvious choice. Copper tubes have a proven track record and meet the various standards across the world for medical gas applications. Safety standards for oxygen and other positive pressure medical gas require the use of type K or L copper tube. More recent is that copper's non-inflammable capabilities are especially significant where an emergency may occur and the people are less mobile or elderly, Powell said. Copper's melting point is 1,984 Fahrenheit, far higher than that of plastic which will soften at about 300 degrees and emit smoke when exposed to flames. Plastic tubing also expands and contracts up to 10 times more than copper when exposed to intense heat, making it less likely that the system can be put back into service. The healthcare industry routinely uses copper tubing to dispense compressed medical air, oxygen, and nitrous oxide critical for patient treatment and care, nitrogen and compressed air to operate life-saving tools, surgical and treatment equipment, and to operate the medical vacuum system, which remove gases and fluids from patient treatment areas and surgery. Whether in surgery at a hospital, care at a dentist's office, or treatment at an outpatient facility, copper tubing plays an integral part in the medical procedure.